everybody, and today I'm going to show you how to draw a magic wolf. So, you can turn your paper however you want, but I'm keeping mine up like this. So, first, we're going to do her head, which is up here. So, you're going to draw your circle for her head. And now we're going to do her nose. Going to come down. Like that. And do a wolf nose. And I'm making her nose a little bit thinner. Like this one. So I'm going to... Make her nose a little bit thinner and make this come up a little bit more. Like that. And I'm going to make her head a little bit smaller. So now we're going to do her ears. So are you going to do this? Kind of a curved shape. And then like that. Another kind of curve shape. And you're going to do... Not like that. You're going to... The outside of her ear, however you want. The part we just drew down here was the inside of her ear. So this part's the outside, so it needs to be a little bit bigger to make her ear thicker. So now we're going to do her other ear. We're going to make it bent down a little bit. And so we're going to do that, and then like that, like that. So there's her ears. Now we're going to do her chest. It's very fluffy, so you're going to sharply turn back and do some nice fluffy fur for her chest. Then you're going to do her neck, so you're going to come out. Do some nice fluffy neck. Now we're going to do her front legs. So you're going to come down. Might even go off the page, which is fine. And like this one, I have the wing shape on her shoulder. I'm going to do that. So you're going to come up like this and do a wing shape. Like that for his wing. Now we're going to do her other side of her leg and come down. I'm not going to do her paw, his paws. So now we're going to do his other leg. So you're going to come out and just go into this and then do line like that so there's our magic wolf's legs so now we're going to do her back his back so you're going to come down like that and you're not going to draw anywhere near here and you're going to come down and do his back legs however you do your dog's back legs and just come down and do his belly so then we're going to do his other back leg and we're going to come out like this and then like that so he's walking so now we're gonna do our magic wolf's mini tails i'm gonna draw a bunch of tails so i'm going to draw one like this Now you're going to come out and do that. And then you can add as many tails as you want. So now I have all of his tails. You can do as many as you want. On this one, I did seven tails. And on this one, I did one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 
seven, eight tails. So after this, you're going to go, we're going to do his face. So we're going to erase the original circle that you did. That. And then you're going to do his eyes. Like this one, they're football shaped. So you can do his eyes football shaped if you want to, but you don't have to. His eyes are a little bit bigger. And I did all of her eyes black except for the highlight. So we can do that with ours. Like that. And you can make his eyes a little bit smaller than how I did mine. So. Like that. Like that. So there's his eyes. And I'm sorry if you can't see this very well. It's kind of a light pencil. So I'm going to trace over it Sharpie at the end so you can see it. Now we're going to do his nose. You're going to come out. And like that. Can make his nose a little bit bigger than hers. Her nose is a little bit tiny. So I'm making his a little bit bigger. Like that. So now that we have our wolf, we can add little spots on the end of his tails. Like that. And now I'm going to trace over him in Sharpie. I'm sorry if I'm going a little bit too fast for you. You can just pause the video and catch up. So now I'm going to take my Sharpie and trace over him. So you can see him. And then you can color him if you want to. So I shaded hers. So she's dark blue up here and then it fades out into light blue. Then I did her paws dark blue into light blue and then around her tail did that so you can do that with the wolf that we are doing but you don't have to you can color all of them or not at all so so i added in some feathers on his wing and I added in his paws, but you don't have to add them in, and, and now you can, I added little tiny little lines right here at the edge of his ears, I don't know if you can see this or not, but, so here's our magic wolf.